about my personality. Some would call it bipolar, maybe. Oh, fuck. I thought you were talking about Hank. Not what pussy you can get for yourself. Thank you. But what pussy you can get for your country. <laughs> did you see the Nebraska volleyball team news? No, of course not. <laughs> no, I did not. Dog. So, some... Are they tight? Some, Big booties, tiny tits? Some dumb broad on the team, dude, was taking uh, pictures after they won the Big Ten championship. And it's all them in the locker room, dude. Why would they take pictures chicks, in the locker room? Bro, they're chicks, chicks dude. during a celebration. Crazy, dude. <laughs> they, they, they're, they're fucking wild, bro. Just like twerking in their underwear. Just flashing tits to their friend. Like and shit. And then like, <laughs> like, oh my God, so many videos. Like them dancing, like just naked in the locker room. Like, And it went on through like the whole season. This lady, this girl well, was taking videos. I mean, and somehow they leaked, like... Somehow dude, they you, leave. You've never been part of a winning but, football team, dude. I loved flashing my but, dick to my bros in the <laughs> I was locker like, room. Bro, I was like, like dude, we won. Look no, at my dick. No, I was thinking about it, and I was like, guys don't really, like, it's, like, yeah, you'll be like, ah, you know, like, to your friends. <laughs> but, like, you're not really going to be like, ah, to your friends or, like, Whoa, doing anything. Oh, actually, know? yeah. But, like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, sometimes you will and stuff. But, like, uh, when I'm the looking fly? at these you never pictures, seen the fly? Like, everybody's like, God, it's crazy what these young girls were doing. Like, it's nuts. And it's like. Dude, if guys had tits, oh yeah, like if that was just like your chest, like it's not really that sexual of a thing when you break down tits. No. Like imagine me and you having tits, we'd be showing each other our tits all the time. Be like, hey, nice tits. Yeah, yeah, those like, are good. What size are those? Yeah, I'd be like trying to touch you with my tit and stuff. <laughs> like, <laughs> I would, oh yeah, I that be, is a lump, right? Yeah, I, I would like, be no. dribbling your head with my tits. Dude, that's like <laughs> that's what they were doing. Like, there's like videos of them like just in downtown. busting Foster's cans with them. Just they're in like downtown Lincoln, you know, and they're fucking like one of the girls is just walking downtown and goes, "Hey, Brittany," and just turns around and her tits just out. She's like, "God damn it, what are you doing?" Like they all just start laughing. We do like, do that with our balls, though. We yeah. do that with our balls. It's they're harder to get out, though. Which those are arguably as sexual as tits are, because the just ball, about. It's just it's just a, it's, it's just not a, really anything. It's a nut. Yeah, it's just kind of there. It's, it's not just, the dick. It's not part of it, but it is. You know? I don't think any woman, though, is, is Googling balls, but I do know that plenty of teenage boys are Googling tits. They might be Googling balls, though. You don't know. You know what my, you know what my girlfriend likes? Okay. You know what my girlfriend likes watching? She likes watching guys jerk off on porn. Really? Yeah. I mean, yeah, it's just a di- it's the only thing you like. Yeah. Like a dick. But which is weird because... I I do get off and have gotten off to like just a girl masturbating. We know. I have that also. Yeah, for sure. Well, she, the, but, he had tits, but well, he had tits. So, well, so she's that's a, a different well, story. she's a guy. So uh, <laughs> she had a penis. So it's okay. Well, it's like the Britney Griner video, dude. That's but like that's crazy. that's not like my thing though. Is like girls masturbating. Like, but her thing is like dudes. Ma- she loves watching like dudes jerking off. Inter- Which that, is so just, interesting. That's supremely interesting to me. Yeah. Because I'm like... Girls like to look at peen, dude. It's not yeah. that crazy of a thought. But but wouldn't you... Th- like... Wouldn't you theoretically, like... Yes. Want to see what your part in the sex is? Does yeah. You never watched a solo? No, I don't really get it. Oh, I like a yeah. solo. Like you like uh, Jonah Hill from Superbad. You ever seen a vag just by itself? Not for me. Oh, well, for me. No, it's not, no. <laughs> like it is for me, but like I want I want to see P and the G. I do want to see no, P and the G. I like I like D in the in in the V. D in the Dildo in the V. Dildo in the V. <laughs> it's nice. Okay. I like a solo. V. Solo is nice. I, I do yeah, like that. I, I yeah. guess I'm not a, a it, I mean, it's that's not still as is. Burst, I guess. I guess it is still technically P in the V, but it's it is. Not it's, P it's, 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 it's a P in the V. It's a P in the V. It's her putting the P in the V. Dude, it's APV. <laughs> alien. AVP. <laughs> alien predator vagina. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, I love uh, the death of a bit. Just, uh, uh, just the, that's like the, the, the. That's where it led to. That's uh, a porn parody of Alien versus Predator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> alien alien predator. badge Predator. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Alien Virgin Predator. There you go. Yeah. Aliens trying to break the hymen. No, man. <laughs> they do it with the mouth. <laughs> Dude, it would be hilarious if your penis had like a little penis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> 
Uh, Christ. <laughs> I love this podcast so much. <laughs> yeah, we, unfortunately, oh we God. can't, but it would be hilarious to call it If Your Penis Had a Little Penis. If Your Penis Had a Little Penis. If Your Penis Was Like Alien. <laughs> yeah, like a little mouth within the mouth. Um, <laughs> this is a long title. What if your penis was like Alien from the movie oh Alien? Oh, my God. If your penis dude, had a little penis Black dudes would be killing people, dude. Just... <laughs> <laughs> just right through the mouth. Like, just like Hancock, <sighs> get off, get off, get off. <laughs> <laughs> Which means every time I see that scene, dude, that means he's killed people. Like he's killed a lady, multiple. Like wait, what? In Hancock, when he comes. he's like, get off, get off. That means he's killed a lady. Just oh. shot a load <laughs> through her right fucking through her skull, whole body. dude. Just the whole like entire a, thing, like a rail gun, just. <laughs> dude, waste <laughs> a fucking brain, dude, all the way through it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's why you got to only fuck gods when you're Hancock. Yeah, but then that makes you not a god. That's we true. saw that in the movie. That's what happens. And he's like, fuck oh, it. Oh, when they're close to each he's other? He's like, fuck it. I'll live on the moon. Right. And then, yeah. Wait, because wait, cause it's like they're they're like each other's kryptonite, right? Which is weird. If this if if Hancock was made in 2022, she that bitch would have moved to the moon. White lady, you're in the moon. Mm-hmm. you to let the black guy stay. Yep. Can't move the black guy. That's crazy. That's well, racist. Nas said, "The world is yours." Mm-hmm. Do you fucking do something about your phone? People like me, dude. <laughs> Dude, it is funny that our phones don't go off at all. Because <laughs> our phones are right there. Oh, well, yeah. Yeah, I mean, but you could still hear a bing. <laughs> Anyhow. What um, if you had a vagina in a vagina? Just for, the, just... for the penis in the penis. Oh. I, well, I suppose if you had a penis within the penis, then the, the, the female of the... Uh, nine. Nine. Um, that would suck if you had a small penis and it, you never reached the inner vagina. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, see, that's the thing, is I don't know that there isn't an inner vagina. <laughs> Damn it, dude. I don't know either. <laughs> Fuck. Obviously, neither does Connor. Dude, you'll, I'll, never I'll never know. I'll never know. I'll never fucking know, dude. <laughs> dude, just an extra Ty, vagina. Is there an inner vagina? Is there an inner vag? No. Well, Ty doesn't know either, dude. We all have a small penis. We're <laughs> fucked. God damn it. Damn it, dude. Yeah. You'll you'll never know how deep the vagina is. It stops at the cervix. How yeah. deep does the pussy But where's go? the cervix at? It's just a couple inches in there. Couple? What? I was like, couple? Nice. My girlfriend's <laughs> got a my girlfriend's got a deep cervix then. Yeah, damn. I mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. Maybe, maybe it right only answer. opens up if you have a little pee in your pee. You know? It might, dude. Might yeah, you break through. <laughs> it's like portals. You break Is that what Jim Morrison like was talking about? Portals. Break on through to the other side. To the other side. Break on, Break on to, through to the, to the other side. <laughs> no one knew he had a nine inch dong, dude. Dude, what did he discover when he was on acid? Oh my god. The other vagina. The other vagina. <laughs> Secondary vagina. <laughs> vagina too, electric boogaloo. <laughs> electric poon baloo. All right, ruined it. Damn it. Right. Soiled it. Soiled Fuck. it. Folks. All right. Think about this. What if you had an asshole within your asshole? I think you actually might. I do. I have two assholes for sure. I feel like you, 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 might have you, have, you have an antechamber yeah, where you I do. can release a bunch of gas and then keep it. The clean. gas goes He's past like He's the, the pool ass. of shit yeah. in my ass and the gas just goes over it. Yeah, and it's like a tar just, pit where like the out. gas just floats above it yeah. and then the tar just sits in you the little. Save the shit. I save the shit. I wait till all the gas has passed through, and then I evacuate the shit. So that way you don't ruin the back of a toilet. Like Hancock ruined the back of that lady. Yes. I mean, yeah, depending on the angle they were at, yeah. I don't know. Ooh, yeah. I mean, doggy style would be a problem, because that's going to ruin your sheets. Yeah. Yeah. It's going probably right through the chest onto the bed. I mean, and if she goes, like, face down on the pillow and then ass up, just right through the spine. Just yeah, <laughs> right up it. Yep. You might like a like a uh what Mortal Kombat finisher. It might yeah. pop her spine with the head attached to the spine still. Oh! <laughs> Dude, actually, finisher. Yeah. Speaking of I mean not alien but predator does rip a guy's spinal like whole Ooh. column out. And I think it's he Predator does. too. Yeah. What an um, asshole. No, I think the first one. Uh um, the first one? Shane what Black's a real character. Dick. Uh the Native American looking guy cuts his chest. He oh, ends yeah. up killing him, and then he rips him out from the asshole, 
from the yeah, asshole yeah, and then up from the, to the head. From the, the taint. You know, Which what is, I don't like is that they're remaking that and it's with Native Americans. No, they already me, already remade. Oh, they already did. It's with a great Native movie. Americans fighting the predator. It is a great movie. I can't get behind it. it behind it, it. I can't it. get behind it just because <laughs> I saw the top Marine squad go up against the guy. With and Jesse killed, the Body Ventura, he killed all of them. Yeah, Jesse the Body. So, no. Okay, well, but if you, if you get past that, it, 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 it's have, years apart, though. Yeah, but he still has all the same shit, though. No, oh, he, does he? he doesn't. He doesn't have the same shit. Yeah, arguably, it's, it's almost like a Star Wars type deal then where the technology the that he shit? had in the 1700s is more advanced than somehow in 1987. It's more advanced. Not, a, but there's like certain that aspects. Even furthers my there's point. certain aspects of it. it. The movie's called Prey, by the way. It's on Hulu. Go watch it. It's pretty but good. I thought it took place. <laughs> that it took even, place in the 1700s. It, yeah, 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 yeah. In it early America. My point. But that's 200 years before the this thing you're talking about. This dude would have fucking walked through people with bow and arrow and rocks. Dude. Actually, if they could build a spaceship to come here, yeah, Bro, it doesn't really make sense. Bro, he would have that... fucked them up. It's a 30-second movie. But it's also, I think it comes from uh, they, the Predators knowing that they are Ty technologically advanced and they hunt for fun. They hunt for sport. Right, right, right. And they try to make it hard for themselves. And then their fallacy is that they end up underestimating their prey. How do you do that? Purposely and then the prey missing fights back. your shots? Like, what, in what world? Well, well like playing make... games with them, like boxing them in. Like, oh, yeah, I could easily kill you, but instead I'm just going to box you into this right. area it, and then hunt you. If the, if the Predator in Predator just wanted to uh, kill the whole squad, he would just hit it in, in the trees. Connor's and not going to drive home the tonight. Rifle. Uh, right? I mean, the, the, the you know, the three... Exactly. The three-dot shoulder rifle, he would have just hid in the tree. How about literally just run up and stab them because he runs like 18 times faster than any human can? Well, That's but true. I would also say, though... This is the Usain Bolt of his planet. This is... It's fucking retarded. So it's a your dumb theory, movie plot. Though, your theory, though... Because of this newer film, it's kind of disproven by 2004's Alien vs. Predator. Yes. Because the whole point of hunting on Earth before people got to be well, technologically advanced yeah. is that they're growing xenomorphs through the people yes. on Earth. I mean, so the canon of the movie is ruined because they tried to make it inclusive. Let's be honest at what happened here. They tried to make the movie inclusive. Not every movie needs to be inclusive. It's a movie about a predator who kills people. Honestly, I, you I mean, don't, you don't really not, have you seen it? You don't have to. Have you seen Prey? No, I haven't seen it. I've just seen the previews. But I mean, by I haven't just seen the previews. just That's looking like saying, at the no, I just previews, read the, the headline. That's it. Just looking at the previews, it's just like. <laughs> What are we doing here, dude? This guy would fuck them up royally. If you, if He'd you fuck watch up the everybody movie. up until he got to the point where he's fighting the fucking Marines. Was like his hardest one yet. I would agree with you if if their intent when they came to Earth and they were, if they just told themselves they were like, all right, I'm gonna fuck, I'm gonna kill them as quickly as I possibly can. Hands down, they could do it, but they don't come down with that no, intent. It's about honor. It's about honor, but, and it's yeah, about the what, sport and the hunt. That's it, what they do. Then they like, know that they can. They know they could kill everybody in a minute without question. They could just drop a bomb from yeah, the they ship drop if they the wanted fucking to. the boop boop boop. Yeah, then the it'd boop, be boop, what? Boop, like yeah. then what? They'd be like duck hunting and still they're fucking getting everybody. Yeah. But that's the thing is they, they don't want to. They don't want they to. They are though. They just are by circumstance, dude. If you like, it's like having a sports video game and you just make a guy ninety nine overall and everybody else is fucking sixty overall. Yeah. He's going to win the scoring title no matter what you fucking do. If well, no. his intent when he comes into it is to kill everybody as fast as possible, but gonna, that's not their intent. What he's going to do is he's going to try to set up. He's going to like roll the ball to them when they're on their own fucking baseline. Exactly. And then catch the pass that they try to throw yeah. and dunk it on somebody because he's like, oh, I can do that. Yeah. He's not going to just run down the court all the whole fucking time. Yeah. yeah in 1987, in movies, Predator, here's what, the thing. They didn't have, he didn't have to talk to them from the trees and give up his position and let him know that he was in the forest. Here's the didn't thing. Have to, what he's saying. But what, he did that to make it fun for with himself. With the analogy that Lex just said, though. What I'm saying is, yeah, he's going to try to do that and fuck with them and have fun. 
but he's not going to miss any dunks. <laughs> In the movies, dude, they have him missing fucking Actually, you dunk know what? after you know what? dunk Actually, after dunk. I'm, I'm sorry. And it's like, dog, I'm this sorry, guy. You, did, you made a really good point. Yeah, this guy wouldn't be missing dunks, dude. It's like a killer whale with a seal, bro. He's going to fuck with it and flip it in the air 40 feet. He's still going to eat the fucking seal. No, yeah. <laughs> like, I, I guess. Where does the seal come from? What? So You've never seen killer whales, whales play with seals? Fuck with seals, dude. I have, yeah. They don't yeah. just eat them. They, they fuck That's with, dude, what it is. Uh, fucking our cat. Right. Fucks with, like, he, he would murder these rabbits. Oh, over yeah. Over the course of, like, three and a half hours. Yeah. And he was like, "Yeah, it's fun." Yeah, he's yeah. Joe Rogan them, has a, a bit all about the rabbits that. Rabbits are gone. <laughs> Joe Rogan has a bit about that. Like cats, like if a cat catches a gerbil, that gerbil has an hour to live, and it's just going to be fifty nine minutes of the cat fucking with it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, and but to your point, that's my point. No rabbit has ever killed my cat. <laughs> so that is true. That's what I'm that's saying. Yeah. No, you're right. It's never going to happen, yeah. dude. It's like Will Chamberlain when he entered the NBA. Well, I mean, it's just fucking. Though, you yeah. can try, dude. Sure, you shoot fucking forty percent from the field, but I can just walk <laughs> into the zone and dunk five. the ball. <laughs> like what? five? Yeah, I'm giving that a like, three. All right. I feel like you didn't. I'm sorry for interrupting. I want them fast five. and sharp. All right. Okay. All right. That's why I can just move on. Uh, I it's feel all right, like we dude. Can't it happens. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you have a lackluster. You do. Burp. You do have a. You do pose a good point though with that. They like they wouldn't be missing the half court shots no. at all. Um, yeah, uh, and also in the way in Prey, if you haven't seen it by now, fuck you, spoiler alert, um, she, she beats him by eating a plant that lowers her body temperature so that the, not a thing, the predator can't see it on its infrared. Not also, a thing. Though, I, I do want to point out, I, I have seen one What'd clip. What'd she eat, mint? What the fuck? I've seen one clip from this movie. It was on Sage. The Instagram. Bullshit. Ty's no. looking me in the eyes. He knows it's bullshit. I didn't like that movie. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen one clip on the Instagram, and one rule that the Predator has, which he don't is, be gay, is consistent in. <laughs> no. Highly um, homophobic to the Predator. Yeah, the you Predator is homophobic. You wouldn't know it from his lines because he doesn't have any, but highly the predator homophobic doesn't predator. kill anything that doesn't pose a threat which That's true in prey he has the opportunity he has her like he's ready to go he's got the blades out and then he's right. like he's like no which brings back up the argument of honor yeah because yeah, exactly. it's not it's not fair and it's not a real kill if it's not holding a weapon if it doesn't pose a threat to it yeah, yeah. is he yeah. even really a predator he seems just like does a he fighter. even fuck kids like, i mean he's just Jesus. a ufc fighter if we're being honest this guy he's not really a predator because if he was a predator and he's hunting prey what a lion gives a fuck what a gazelle's got no it doesn't give a fuck no, it's, it's gonna it's... eat the gazelle okay. like <laughs> but, but but clint you know like a what is it this guy's Human... just a piece of shit Oh, you know, the guy's a piece of shit. Don't get me wrong. But, like, human hunters. Like, if you went out to go shoot a deer, right? And then somehow you're sitting in your, like, hiding place or whatever. You're sitting in, like, the middle of a field in a whatever tent. And then a deer comes and sticks its nose in your face. You're not going to shoot that deer. No. You'd you love like, that deer. You'd be like, oh. You're like, oh, okay. Just walk away, I guess. That's fine. Yeah. Depends. Where am I at in the hunting season? <laughs> How many tags do I have left? Yes. And How also, much money were those tags? And also, is my knife sharp? Is it a doe? Yes, is it, it a is. buck? Because no, I'll tell you this: no bucks just walking up to you. No, that's true. It's I've not. seen so many videos of dudes if they're if they're in the rut, sitting there. If they're in the rut, then yes, because yeah, they're disoriented. Yeah, they're fucking retarded. They're just like, that time. No! They're just like pussy. I want to come. Well, yeah, <laughs> I want to come. But that's and my point: just, is that these <laughs> dudes are sitting her. like on the ground with their rifles pointed at it, but it's as close as you are to me. And yeah. They're like, it's I like guess, can I, no, the, we're not going to do you that. Don't the hunt, buck is literally like, can I fuck you? You don't can I fuck you. You don't hunt a. You, you don't kill something that's in, like, an uh, animal that's in the rut because it's about to reproduce. That's, no, you, that's like part of the rules. That's the point, though, that he's been trying to make this whole time and that I've been trying to reinforce is that the predator would see that and he would be like, oh, okay, let's, we'll let him go. Yeah. Because if it's a different species, it's not looking at us as if it understands our emotions and the they way that we live. They don't think humans they, are threats all the time. They don't think that. They're like, they're just like the deer who walks too it's close. Like they're like us it's us looking not... at a deer. Yeah. 
You know, it's like, oh shit, it's running. Let me run and, after it. And and certainly there have been plenty of times where a deer has like gored a hunter mm-hmm. on accident. Like the hunter didn't mean to get that close or whatever, and the deer just fucking got him. Yeah, <laughs> sliced him in the eye. Two. One. Here's the thing, guys. Damn it. It's a bad movie. You haven't I'm seen not defending it. The movie. You also I've haven't not seen, seen it. it. You haven't seen it. I don't you have haven't to. seen it. I don't have to to know it's bad. Just watch it. The person who has seen it told me just it's watch bad. It. He's right there. You can talk to him. He I think he just doesn't want this to be the movie review that we're doing. You know it's what I mean? It's not going to be the movie I, review that yeah. we're doing. Uh, 100% won. Four and then four. Wow. I'm going to give four. that all together in eight. Which Same is time. four and four. Same thing, but different. Clint knows how to add. <laughs> <laughs> bling. No, dude. Bling, it's, bling. It is a decent movie. It has far less of the inclusive Hollywood bullshit to make more money in it than you think. It really doesn't have that much. It's it's not all about just being an indigenous person in America. It I is mean, a little bit because it's all about indigenous people in America. That's, all, that's, that's what the whole, the whole movie's right, about. Yeah, but it's not it's not like you I see... I guarantee you there's a line about how the white man's bad. No? So that's actually surprising. I don't think... No, it's not about white people at all. But if you think about it in a certain way, it is metaphorical in that sense. No, wait, no, 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 no. Hold on. There is the colony of French people that fuck them up. And they're like, <laughs> French white people are terrible. <laughs> Call it. It looks so cheap. It looks like a Lifetime movie. Oh, like the production quality is bad? Looks- I mean, it's already, already on Hulu. It didn't even get Netflix, dude. It got Hulu. Hulu, dude. No, but it was it was, it was was primed movie, for Hulu. Dude. It was slated for Hulu. <laughs> was it? I'm sure uh, they made a lot of money off of it, too. I'm sure it was slated for Netflix, and Netflix went, mm, not taking this piece of I'm shit. Sure eventually, <laughs> and, and, I'm sure eventually Prey will be on Netflix. Probably. Eventually. Yeah, probably when Hulu drops it and Netflix can get it for nine dollars, <laughs> and then they're gonna make millions yeah. off of we'll it. We'll put that on there and let nine people watch that. Look, all I'm saying is that Prey on Hulu is more entertaining than any Steven Seagal movie besides well, Under Siege. I mean, okay, I was gonna say yeah. before you said before you said the caveat. I suppose I was like, wait a sec, have yeah. you seen Under Siege? I have. Steven Seagal. Let me put it this way: Steven Seagal is an incredible cook in that movie. He should do a self-made documentary. Haven't he already? (laughs) Or isn't every movie? No, where they uh, just follow him around. Yeah, well, they did the whole police show. Yeah, Yeah, where he's a cop. No, no, no. I don't know if you do this, but I've been a cop for the past twenty years. Not playing a cop. None of that. Like a Russian oligarch invited me over for dinner. Like, and I got to go over it. Like that shit. His actual life. (laughs) Hold on. Hold on. I got to. I got to dye my hair today. Yeah, I was gonna say I got to use this printer cartridge to dye my hair. That shit. Yeah, (laughs) that shit. He's like, where, where, where are my John Lennon sunglasses at? It, it would probably yeah. get him back into the good graces of the people. What's it like for the self-awareness? He's already in the good yeah. graces of the people. There is something about like Russia. having oh, yeah, Russia. and like putting in front of people that self-awareness about yourself that makes people go like, oh, he knows he's he knows fucking he's retarded. Crazy. He knows he's stupid. Okay. Yeah, he gets it. And then people buy it. I don't in. know that if he, if he knows it or if he's just like, this is my whole thing. No, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, along Nicholas the line, Nicholas Cage yeah. knows it. He Nicholas does Cage know. knows it, especially that's why since he rules. the 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 self referential movie. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah no, he gets it. Seagal unbearable needs weight. one of those. He needs the unbearable weight of weight because <laughs> he yeah. is just fat as shit. Now. Yeah, Seagal needs one of those Nicholas Cage movies. Where he does. He's making fun of him. Yeah, we're, we're, yeah. he's yeah. just the washed up it's just, action dude who's like, yeah. okay, I, I, what if I what if I kick like down low though? Yeah. <laughs> what are what are some it's big movies of going his? From like There's, set to set. Because you know he's working on like nine movies. Nine now. movies at once. You know, he's to like, DVD. one of these is gonna work, yeah. dude. One I of these is gonna I, hit. I don't remember the name. Dude, I, under Siege. I know this Under Siege. I fuck. I can't remember any off the top of my head. But Ty, what are some Steven Seagal movies? Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> Steven Seagal hits or whatever. Yeah. Um, Ready Player nothing, One. Nothing Get the recent. fuck out of here. He's in not Ready Steven Player Spielberg. One. No, he's not. Steven Spielberg. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Beyond the Law. Um, to kill. Holy All these shit. Are exactly that the same. That is so many. Hold on. Oh, March for quick. Death. Out for Count- du- Justice. Above the Law. Three, Above the Law. Four, That's right. Uh, on Deadly Ground. I, I think I've seen. Um... If he makes a documentary about himself called Above the Lard. I feel like we could. I feel like we really Dude, could get to know the real I lose the above the lard. Above the lard, <laughs> and you just have a, a gun that's just a stick of butter. Just yeah. um, a a dangerous man. 
Jesus Christ. Look at all the angles on Marty these titles. At 40. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, you're just adding Did up you the count films. them? 48 no, movies. 48. I think the last one that I saw, could you scroll down a little Out bit? Out of more? reach. I think the last one that I saw was on Deadly Ground because I just watched Under Siege. Oh, yeah. Belly of the Beast. I forgot about that. That's a big one. That that maybe he just called that's his documentary right there. Belly, Belly of, the, of the Beast. Belly of the Beast. But the Beast is Putin. Hair dye of the Beast. <laughs> what about that? Wait, no. Just ridiculous. Okay. I, Wait, of could Steven you click Seagal, on that again? Half the ballad, the ballad of Steven Seagal. Yeah. Is that? No, I'm just, I'm just. That what's... is LL Cool J. Like Fast and Furious. Yeah, I was about to say. Like, Why they steal? <laughs> Wait, the is fucking... he actually in Fast and Furious? He might, dude. He might. No, he no he's him. not. He's not. That's from 2002. Wait, what's yeah, the wait, one what that's is... uh, what's the one that's right next to that movie that looks like Fast and Furious? The Ticker. Ticker. Hmm. <laughs> ticker. Uh, ticker. Yeah. Whoa. Does he have a, a black uh, two co- stars co- lead? Hell yeah. Is that fucking Dennis Hopper? It says Nas. Nas. Oh, Nas? <laughs> no. That. If you think about it. If you think about it, that's probably really good for Nas's Dude, career. Dude, I just fucking love the idea that he's going down Eminem's like best rapper list doing movies with him. He's like, it's Reggie, Jay Z. Oh Tupac, my god, and Tom have Sizemore. Heard, Tom Sizemore's in it. Story. I forget which rapper it was. It was at DMX's house, and DMX has framed like all the movie posters that he's been in. Yeah. Oh, you, a, like you didn't watch Cradle to the Grave? Like, yeah. Well, no, but. <laughs> The, this rapper's like, damn, bro, like, you're really working on your filmography. Like, you've got, you're in a lot of fucking pictures. Yeah. And DMX, like, pauses for a second from rolling a blunt and, like, looks at him and goes, motherfucker, what's a filmography? <laughs> like, <laughs> what's a filmography? And then, he, and then he was like, how many films you've been in? He's like, then just say that, motherfucker. Ty, Don't come in you, here with that. Can you go back to the list of movies? He's like, Hey. Oh, that's so oh. it's so great. So many. Motherfucker, what's a filmography? <laughs> what I what is what what is it with like uh certain like male action stars of a certain age group where they just start making all of these terrible oh, movies? Oh shit, he was a machete? Dude, cuz you're reaching, dude. Dang. Was dude. he a machete? Yeah. Nice. That's so, okay. Wait, also, what is maximum conviction? Oh no! Sounds sick. And well, is that Stone Cold Steve Austin? It's conviction to the max, is what that is. Six. You know what sucks is he I took. I think that might be Stone Cold Steve Austin. That you is know Stone what Cold sucks Steve Austin. Is he took so many good <laughs> movie titles. Yeah, he does. He <laughs> like he, he's killing he the title game. It on titles. Dude. He's Maximum killing the title conviction game. Conviction sounds like a fucking movie in a show. What you is that? They're I mean, like, oh, we gotta go watch Maximum Convention. General Commander. <laughs> The Asian Connection, Code of Honor, Absolution, Force of Execution. The Asian Connection. Salesman. China <laughs> Salesman. Please click on that. Mike Tyson. Chi- oh it's my got, God. It's got no Iron way. Mike Tyson in it. China Salesman. Dude, we might just have to watch a movie. Dude, we're going to have to watch a Seagal movie. Oh my God. Dude, we got to. Um, Wait, Mystery you know what we got to watch? That we got to watch uh, Under Siege 2. Under Siege 2. Even CG, <laughs> even CG. I wonder if we could get away with that on copyrights. What? Just MST. No, if we just Fucking mystery people watch. If we podcast. just mystery science theater, shitty Steven Seagal movies. Yeah. I feel like we could just put those well, on. We your... could put it on Patreon for sure. No, we could definitely we put those. Show the video. No, I think we could put it on YouTube if we show the video, but we're like talking through the entire. If we don't thing. put the audio. We could put the video. <laughs> End of a gun. Or if we, like if, if, we, they if hear, we don't put the video, yeah. we could put the audio. If they hear like twenty lines, I think we're safe. <laughs> like <laughs> you know, he yeah. The only reason he's making these movies is because he does have a solid fan base, and there's a group of people in just rural Appalachia that love to watch this shit. Yeah, they're, they're just they're just like Steve is a god fuck man, man. Yeah, you there's no, still- there's a guy that has all of those, all of them. You get They're all still forty-eight their of them. And then Every like, cigar. Oh, well, you all watch Under Siege again? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna watch like, uh, Kill is, Switch like, later tonight. Dude, uh, you know there's a guy that has like a movie room that is like separated by actor. <laughs> like so not I, even like I got all the Bruce Willis movies exactly. right here. I got Nicolas Cage right here. I, I got, got I got Die Hard through Die Hardest. Yeah, yeah Die, die the then, Hardest. No, but like it goes all the so. Covers are like parodies on other things. Yeah, yeah, exactly. They're all. Like, it's almost like they're sniper. all in the American same sniper. universe. Sniper. Yeah, American right. Sniper. That one's like, uh, what's the? You know what he's doing is he is. 
I remember going He's into Blockbuster. Movies, dude. I remember yeah. going into Blockbuster and seeing next to Transformers was Transmorphers. That's what he's doing with all of these oh, movies. Shit. He's like, Wait, uh, yes. he's like, you like Transformers? How about Transmorphers? Ty, Ty, and he just does that, the thing. What is that? Thing. What's the Amanda Show sketch that they had? I don't. Know. The Amanda <laughs> Show. Dude, please tell me you remember that sketch. And it was the video yeah. store. And they're like, oh, you want Austin Powers? How about like? Oh, like, how about Dobson Bowers? Yeah, Dobson Bowers, and it yeah. was just them in the movie. Like, yeah, that's exactly <laughs> what he does. I, I, that's what he tries to do. Yeah. He tries to one up the movie that he likes. He's like, they like this. I, I want to one up it right now. And he tries to make Sniper fucking Ty, Ty, even you snipier. Know what I'm talking about with like it. It's like a uh, a movie company that exclusively makes, yeah, like movies that are just shitty, they're but rip-offs of yeah, they're, they're right. ripoffs. Other stuff. Bollywood. They're called. Oh shit! It's right on the tip of my tongue. It's called. It's called Bollywood. No, no, it's an American company. They just uh, just B movies. But, yeah, they were, oh, but there's a word for it. I got it. Like like right. so Bollywood of, America instead of. Pacific Rim, it would be like specific robot rim. fight. It would be yeah, it would be like it would be like robot ocean. Right, yeah. It'd be like, wait, well, that doesn't make any sense. Or like uh instead ocean of a, a day after tomorrow, it'd be like uh like like ten point oh earthquake, you know? Yeah, they just yeah, do it would, shit it would like be that. Something like just like slightly off. So yeah. day after tomorrow is yesterday was terrible. Speed <laughs> yeah, exactly. I wanna say it's called like oh shit. No, I want to. No, there's a specific word for it. Yeah, or no, no, like their. Company, I'm gonna find it when I when I edit the video, and that's what I'm gonna title this their episode. Their company is called <laughs> something in particular. Uh, four. Mm. Um, I liked it. But six. I can't think of it off the top of my head. But they that's make right. all those like, like instead of like real steel, they're like they're like. Like true iron, and yeah. they make like a movie about like about fucking like robots fighting, and then yeah. they're like they just release it. Yeah, they just they just siphon off any excess money that people who are dumb, dumb enough, enough not to, to buy Pacific yeah, not, Rim, yeah, exactly, and they buy this one instead. That's exactly what it's for. Because I was like, I don't know. When did the first Transform... 2007? So I was like 14, 15, and I almost rented Transmorphers on accident. Right. That's what they're trying to do, like the accidental purchases. You know, and then people are like, all right, well, I'll watch this. Like, what the fuck is it? He didn't even reload the gun. You know, he didn't even do this. Transmorphers. Can you please... Mockbusters. There you go. Can you please just pull up a clip from Transmorphers? Like, I need to see a Transmorpher transforming. Transmorphers. I, I remember that. Robots dude. in the picture. I, I <laughs> almost god, rented I that. It. Oh my god. Whoa. What? Wait, but can you can you Oh no, we'll do it. At the box office and on pop culture with low budget thrills and genre bending chills. Suggest you have fun and spend your money. But this isn't movie, about it though. No, it, movie, this is a five minute what it takes to earn B movie like of honor. Can you pause it real quick? Can you pause it, Ty? Ty, can you pause it? Ty. Ty, pause it. Ty, pause it. Pause it. Pause. Ty, pause it. Jesus Christ. Can you, can you scroll down? It's so loud. It is very loud. Ty. Ty. Can you scroll down to the... Uh, Ty, no. Um, like, to what the production company is called. Um, this is Transmorphers, Inc. That's oh, all no, they I guess did. not. So it's a specific production company's name that. Yeah, no, wait, wait, wait! Go back, go back, go back, go back. What, metal the, Man. The, <laughs> metal Metal Man. <laughs> Is that an Iron Man ripoff? Oh my god, dude! <laughs> Was that produced in in Guadalajara, Mexico? Captain Battle, dude. Yeah. Black Black Bat. Bat. <laughs> oh my god, dude! <laughs> yeah, dude, these are great. Dude, this is better than that D hit different when he broke. <laughs> <laughs> no, it is not. Are That's you true. Me? Oh yeah. my god, I forgot what we what? need to still Sinister leave. Squad. Look at that shit. Avenging yeah, Force. Wait, could, could you click on that Avenging Force, the the Scarab or whatever? Because oh my. God. Because I, could, I think that uh, if you scroll down, that looks like a porn. It does look like a porn. It does look like a porn. <laughs> the Scarab. Um, I want to say all of these movies are like produced by the same production company. No way. Um, but I can't think of what it's called. Um, Whoa. 
Nah. That's crazy. Yeah. I'll think of it later. Can you go? Uh, can you go back? Oh up no, that's Ty. Right. Yeah. What's up? Production. That's pretty funny. <laughs> you know what this this is? Uh, like, you yeah, hear about the the um, the children's. There it is. There it is. <laughs> Dudes production. <laughs> oh my god, they. Jurassic. You Shark. know what? You know what sucks is that they are fucking millionaires. They're oh, millionaires. She Rex. What the fuck is She Rex? <laughs> oh my god, dude. Attack of the Giant Leeches. <laughs> Pray for the B six. Uh, Kingdom of the Vampire. Have you heard about this? Uh, it's not a. It's not a fake charity, but it's a charity that piggybacks off of uh, Make a Wish. Where it's called Wish Kids, yeah, 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 yeah. and the, apparently they, they only like B listers. Actually, no, but like Wish we Kids, the they only spend three percent of the donations on the kids. And where they, Make a yeah. Wish spends like ninety percent. This is the same fucking thing, dude. Actually, Ty, could you just look up Asylum? Dude, production? that is so crazy though that they have to like actually pay those guys. Like instead of just being like, "Hey, John Cena, the second can, one down. can you come meet?" 50 kids who are going to die in a week. We're going to pay like you $500. Pay them $500,000. I think asylum they, is what know? I'm thinking of. Like, yeah. that's fucking crazy. Instead of them just being like, yeah, of course. Oh, this is in videos. Uh, yeah, I think Asylum Productions, yeah, is they just do this shit where they, they make slightly different Law- <laughs> lawsuits and legal issues. And they, yeah, <laughs> they have to always pay money. Because yeah, yeah, their film American Battleship, right as Battleship came out, they just made like a shitty movie. Do they like hear leaks about movies that are going to be produced, Probably, and they're like, yeah. "All right, we're going to beat them to it." Dude, I wouldn't be surprised if it's the writers of the movies that are getting made, like in the big time, and they're not getting any credit for it, and they're just like, "Oh," just and they just sell it. like the idea <laughs> yeah, just, to somebody else. Is like, here's yeah, the thing: I'll yeah. take, I'll take a hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, they just and you down. just. Just do what you can oh, with shit. Battleship. Sometimes feature more overtly sexual or graphic violence in their major studio counterparts. Oh, so it is porn. Sometimes. Borderline. Oh, okay. Borderline porn. So this is this is like softcore porn with like knives well, no, and guns and softcore shit. No, it's not softcore porn. It's like right before softcore porn. Really? It's like yes. as much as you could possibly get allowed with and still Because softcore in, porn will show like tits R. and ass yeah. and stuff. Yeah, but they don't show P and G. They that don't is, show I think the difference. Well, you can show like active humping. Um, fuck. Also, blowjobs I think are good to go in softcore. No, they're not. I you can't show dick. You I can't swear, show vagina. Dude, when I was a kid, no, dude. I watch bro, Witches of Breastwick. Okay, no, I know. When I was a kid, and we had we had uh, what was it? Stars. Could you click on list? We of had asylum stars. Films? You wait. You you stay up till like one in the morning watching stars as a kid. That's true. You mean. Yeah. I saw spanking some, it five times in a row. Yeah, exactly. I saw some beaches, dude. And trying to clean up the leather couch as best you can. I saw some beaches. Yeah, yeah. See, like da, da Vinci, Vinci Treasure. treasure. <laughs> is it, wait, is that National Treasure? And the Pirates of Treasure Island? Island. They're all like that type of shit. Oh, my God. Where, uh, yeah, so it like they were fighting the exorcism of Emily Rose, I think. And then oh my they, God. they made exorcism, the possession of Gail Bowers. 2006 <laughs> was a busy fucking year for them, dude. dude. They went off. Oh, my. King of the Ants. Oh, wait. I saw King of the Ants. I remember that. There's full on dick in there. Dude, oh, yeah. Dude, was there's a full also, dick in King of the Ants. Also, wait. That holy shit. Hot... Something we've talked about. AVH is their Alien versus Hunter instead of Alien Oh, yeah. Hunter. Alien versus Hunter. Bro, 05 to fucking 07, they were putting in. They were putting on a train? Dog. Yeah, I remember making, Snakes on a Train. Was yeah, I remember that. Slightly it years. was right next to Snakes on a Plane. Yeah, they're making slightly different versions of movies, which are great. 30,000 Leagues Under the Sea, they just remade it. Yeah, they also, <laughs> yeah I was going to say, they just, <laughs> just made that Journey to the Center of the Earth. And, uh, oh yeah, instead of Speed Racer, Street in, Racer. In 2008, underneath, 19-year-old virgin. underneath Sunday School, that's uh, purple, a little bit above there, the day the Earth what? Stop! Instead of the day the Earth earth stood still, the day (laughs) the Earth stopped. Ridiculous, dude! Oh my God! These are all yeah. War of the Worlds two next wave. Uh, Electric Boogaloo! Electric Boogaloo! Damn it! Year is. uh, You had your opportunity. Oh shit! I didn't even see that. Oh yeah! Perfect. That's insane, dude. One They're... million BC is great. It's <laughs> <laughs> fucking fantastic. <laughs> well, yeah, but this happened. That's ridiculous, this dude. This happened dude, before. Time, I, I, for whatever reason, I wasn't even looking over there. But yeah, that's that's great that they have 
Yeah, paranormal entity, <laughs> paranormal activity, the this, this spoof. That's crazy, dude. Because, like, if you think about it, that's really smart. I bet you paranormal entity is pretty good. It's well, probably the hold same on, as though. paranormal Because if you, if you think about it, this, <laughs> like, that if, movie costs, like, $30. Dude, if make. you're, this is a really good idea if you're, like, Ed, Ed, and Eddie. You know? Like, if you're, like, I've really got to get some jawbreakers. we got to find a way to get some money. <laughs> yeah. You know? <laughs> It's an Ed, Ed, and Eddie it's scheme. It's an Ed, Ed, and Eddie scheme, dude. You're just like, we're just going to make titles of movies and put them right next to the actual movie, and we're just going to get whatever excess money comes from that dude, that's, from yeah, people exactly. who can't speak English that well. Who don't know the difference. Who don't yeah. know the fucking difference, and they, they're, maybe dude, there's some maybe there's some tits in Metal Man. You don't know. What's crazy is there's that many people that don't know the difference. That don't like, know, the do difference. Not know the difference. You don't between, speak English. You don't why. speak English. Yeah, but between Iron Man and Metal Man, dude, how do you not know the difference? That's 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 huge. Also, Crazy. also, real quick, Prometheus, their name was Alien Origin, <laughs> which actually makes that's more way better. sense. That's way better Prometheus. than Prometheus. Because I didn't know it was an alien prequel until the until very you end. Watched it, yeah. Oh, until Atlantic the... Rim. Oh, that was the one I was in Rim. Yeah. Bro, they made Sharknado, dude. They yeah, are, yeah, yeah. They're the makers. They're Sharknado forever. was the most original yeah. idea they had. That's, that's yeah. pretty good. The, well, we took a tornado and put it full of sharks. Dude, Sharknado was an event in my household, dude. My dad was oh, all yeah. in on Sharknado, Sharknado just because oh, really? of how ridiculous it was. It is ridiculous. He loves that shit. Apocalypse oh, wait, Pompeii. Mega Shark versus Becca Shark? Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> wait, what? Oh, is there just God. Asian schoolgirls in there? What? <laughs> Dude, what Wait, is that, is that is that is that Ty click Japanese on that. Mean Girls? Is that what Ty it is? click on the movie? Click on the movie. Ty, go look up some scenes from the movie. <laughs> Do not do that. Asian school. Ty, look oh, up. Oh this. my god, no, no, don't. Never say? mind. Stop. What Four Asian school Full girls stop. are drugged. Oh, okay. Full stop. Full stop. Full stop. We're, Let's move yeah, on. We're not doing that one. <laughs> I'll look that up later. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Yeah, wait. Yes. Yeah, we are. We are so. Z Nation an app? We are so excited about this. Yeah, Bound, uh, the Fifty Shades of Grey story. Yeah, that's funny as fuck. Isn't Z Nation is actually a really successful show? I think Z Nation I is think... actually an app that you played where you killed zombies yeah, no, while yeah, driving first, a car. First television series on sci-fi. They they sort of bullied their way into being considered mainstream and getting on real TV. Well, yeah, with Sharknado. With the success yeah, with of Sharknado, Sharknado sci-fi kind of did pop off. I actually watched Three-Headed Shark Attack. Three-Headed Shark it's Attack. Actually, it's surprisingly good. Really? It's got Danny Trejo. It's great. Oh, no. fuck yeah. Dude, machete? Machete. Zombies. <laughs> Zombies. That's going to that's got to be a scary Oh my movie. god. Dude, this is this is my favorite thing since that D yeah, hit different right. Eight. They just Wait, called it independence. Independence. <laughs> independence like independent day. Like multi like plural of independent. I also love that they just they were like, okay, Suicide Squad. What's another S word? Actually, it's pronounced it's actually squad. Dependent Day, and it's about the day, day your kids move out of your house. Nice. <laughs> oh, my God. This is the great. Glo- the global swarming is great. You know what this is? This is basically like when you're watching the end movie credits, and you're like, you're reading off weird last names. <laughs> like, oh, Demetrio. <laughs> end of the world is just one of them. <laughs> Just Avengers Grim. Hmm. Wait, there's a six-headed shark attack? <laughs> Wait, I missed it? Six-headed shark? We're, we're four Sequel and five. a five-headed shark attack. God damn. Wow. How many headed sharks are there? Well, you, as many as you six, want. As I many think, as you we want. We might get to seven. We're not at 2023 yet. Triassic World. Oh, man, I'd love to see that. This, this, is, this is just a cornucopia of material yeah, right here. Yeah, it's crazy. Oh, my God. What they make in the 2020s? Please tell me they've already made a movie this year. Oh yeah, could you scroll down? 2023. Oh, that would have been that would have been shocked. Oh wait, they, they just Dunn. called their spoof of Attack on Titan Attack on Titan. <laughs> That's crazy. You can't do that. I think you can. Can you? Yeah. Maybe it's because they uh, didn't capitalize the O oh, wait. And on. Also, oh, I love God. that they made Battle for Pantora. <laughs> they already made a spoof of the fucking... Dude, you know what's sad is a bunch of Pantera fans would be like, hey, this isn't fucking Cowboys from Hell. <laughs> Battle for Pantora. Top top Gunner Danger Zone. Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> Danger Zone! Danger Zone! Oh my god, dude. Just swimming wow. in the fucking dough, That's fucking dude. Great. I also love that 
This they're, they're, for like thirty minutes, we're just looking at the screen away from the camera. It's baffling. It's baffling. Though. It is just crazy. the amount of because they they got they got the the money and numbers. So like if we just dude, fucking abuse they, the shit out of production bro, crews for a whole year, dude, we can make just dog, as much as big Hollywood. Dog, if they waited. A year they could get the money together to actually have a good feature film. This is what like, happens. <laughs> that's <laughs> this is what happens when you're just like, I will not stop doing Adderall. I will not stop. I'm gonna keep doing it and making movies. What they should have done, obviously keep making Sharknados, but that's all you make. Bank that money. Yeah. And then they make, got fucking Mark Cuban in one of those. And then they could have made yeah. one really good film you know. that actually made theaters and then started an actual Production company. There is a there's a ton of money in these though. No, I know, but like there's more in creating an avatar. Sure. You know. Sure, if it, if it goes right, but so many so many like actual uh no, oh, what is it? Production companies just go belly up because they support like the wrong movie and they lose like three hundred million dollars. Mm-hmm. I mean, all of because they lose, are the they they stand, movie. they risk a lot more when you're patient and you invest yeah, in when you, like when you a do real right. project. If we are being honest, not one of these is the right one. No, no, they no. Also, well, no, no, no. Well, Sharknado, Sharknado, was, Sharknado, Sharknado was, was the right, the right choice. Um, choice. They had Terry. I, I want to say, uh, Asylum is sort of like the the competitor of. Uh, <laughs> Ty, do you know about a Troma Films? Ten. Yeah. Yeah, I think very Asylum unique. does like what Troma did in the like eighties and nineties. Does that say making like? Does that say spoofs? Bermuda Rhombus or no, something? Bermuda what is Triangle. it? Bermuda Rhombus. Oh, Bermuda Tentacles. <laughs> oh God, damn! <laughs> That's even worse. Bermuda That's Rhombus. Porn. Would have made That's sense. porn right there, dude. Bermuda Rhombus. <laughs> That's great. Bermuda. Okay, honestly, let's just call this episode uh, Bermuda Rhombus. Bermuda Rhombus, dude. It's wild. Dude, it's so great. Literally 40% of America will understand. Probably less, to yeah, be honest. It's probably less. Bermuda Rhombus. Shit, That's Home Alone with Animals. <laughs> dude, they made Home Alone with Dogs. Alone That's Christmas. The best. Is what it's called. Bro, it's probably oh, that's honestly. Tight. I know Home Alone's a good movie, but that one's probably more probably adorable. Better. It's probably more adorable and better <laughs> than dude, just a pug rolling around, dude, oh during God. Christmas. Dude, I'll take another beer. That's oh wait. Also, uh, scroll down just a sec. I love that uh, Battle L.A. They just made Battle of Los Angeles. <laughs> like, that's so close. Or, or well, your the honor. Three Musketeers. They just made Three Musketeers. Can you just see them in court? Just be like, well, you're oh, with the, the number elf. instead of the your word. Honor, there's enough. There's enough. I don't. There's I don't enough. know if you can read both titles, but if you can read, it's different. How about here's this, that your honor? Slashes instead of dashes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> what is that movie? Oh, eleven, eleven, eleven. You know what's crazy is that this is this is the um, this is the vanilla ice argument right here. It's like no, yeah. no, 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 but no, no. but I did. Yours goes you, doon 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 doon. Mine goes doon 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 doon. And there's a little at the end, but he still had to pay. How do these fucks not have to pay? Oh, they've had to pay a couple times. Oh yeah, they've definitely paid a couple times. There's a couple times. I thought we could get away with it. You know, that's so insane, dude. Just millions. What is that? Your Honor. Oh, yeah. Up. No, they're definitely making money on... Indiana Jones. What is that one to spoof of, the Indiana Jones? Alan, Alan Quatermain and the Temple of Skulls. <laughs> <laughs> Al, wait, that's actually fucking genius, because Alan Quatermain... Um, oh, LXG, shit. right? What? League of Extraordinary Gentlemen. Alan Quatermain. Fucking... No, what's yeah. his name? Sean Connery. No, yes, but that's not... It is not the source material. Oh, (laughs) Uh, dude, LXG. No, yeah, I guess. Yeah, no. Let's roll with it. What were we we gonna say? What were we gonna say? No, um, I I can't think of the name of the book right now. Um, but Alan Quarterman is the name of a hunter in a previous book. The League of Extraordinary Gentlemen draws together all of these literary figures, Uh like Dorian Gray, like... uh, And Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde, those kind of people, yeah. And they they gather them all together. And Nemo. And, yeah. And then they they put them in one place. But I'm like, that's not the origin of any of these people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. (laughs) And so I just thought it was funny that, like... I was like, oh, that guy. Yeah, LXG. Yeah. What was their first one? Belly fruit. What? No way there's not teen tits in that. 
There's tits in that. That's 1999, dude. Yeah. Belly fruit. Is that? I think there's boobs in probably all of these. Yeah, I would. I would assume so. It's a I don't good think assumption. there's boobs in Sharknado because I watched that with my father, and we both would have been like. Those are on the sci-fi tit? channel. Is that a tit? No, no, the, the, those are made for TV. Though. There are no Tara Reid tits in there. Bummer. But I mean, Bummer. Just, just Google. But what, what kind of tits does she have? Foreplay's for sure know. got tits. Foreplay that's got tits. Scarecrow, Scarecrow. tits. Ooh, bloody tits. Tits. The source. I can just tell by the way tits. the girls are on the... Uh, oh, shit. I yeah. Look at the frosted tips. There's tits in there. <laughs> King of the Ants, there's dick in there. There's... <laughs> There's Dick and King of the Ants. I, I remember my dad watched that, uh, fucking rented that. King of the Ants? King of the Ants. I remember the title because it was King of the Ants. It looked like letters carved in someone's stomach, and there was ants all, all over the cover. Ew. I remember I watched it with my dad, Cut. and I, there was the part that I sat down to watch with him. Five minutes later, there was just a huge Hang cock and in it. Hanging dong. It was like this wow. weird fucking torture scene. Letting and I'm just like, out. all right, I guess my dad's... Uh, my dad's into torture. My, I dick guess my porn. dad has... Dick torture porn. A lot better taste in movies than I do. Like, <laughs> what is this What is this art house shit Uh-oh, that I don't understand? Like I'm into something now. Uh, duh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. Look what you created. I remember the dong hang was crazy, too. Of course it was. It was big. Dude, if you're hiring a guy to hang dong, what are you getting... It was a weak, big... It was a weak dong? It was a big white meaty That's one. That's crazy. It was a meaty white dong. Think, meaty think white. Think about yourself, right? You're, you're now. You mine's, know, mine's lean. No, beef. not that. Mine's lean beef. You're doing the uh, what's it called? You're you're Steroids? getting the actors for the uh, for the movie casting. You're casting. Doing, doing casting. You're casting. I'm casting. And on the page, you know, it's a hang dong scene. Yeah. You want to get a real good one. You got to get a photogenic dong. You can't just go I remember there. it was very symmetrical, straight, a lot of hang. What you want is one that you would draw. Yeah. Yeah. It looked like exactly. I could have drawn it. Exactly. Yeah. That's a exactly. Nice, like a nice vein right down the middle. Moderate bush. <laughs> Sorry. Come Rich, on, come Rich on. just the ri- uh, <laughs> How does Rich come up every other fucking episode, dude? He knows. How does Rich he Gary knows. come up every other fucking episode? It. He just takes it. I'm assuming you guys went to Lady Ha Ha. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why did he say that? Because he's probably hearing shit about us. Yeah, probably. <laughs> no, why would we ever go to Lady Ha Ha? Anyway. Message him back to the podcast. I'm just messaging him. Oh, well, I was just going to say, why do you say that? But Facebook Messenger decided to say, what do you say that? What do you say that? All right. Thanks, no, he, Facebook, he, he for gets, making me look retarded. He gets it. Classic Facebook making me look retarded. Rich gets it. Yeah. Yeah, he might. I, I'm so baffled by the, the just the, the names, the years, the the volume of volumes. So, oh, we were talking about meaty, meaty white dicks in movies. You got to get a good one. You got to get a good one. You, you got to get, get one a... that you want to draw or yeah. that you would draw, you know? Yeah. You can't go in there. We're talking about the, the dick that's in King of the Ants. Talk to it, was, about it, it was gotta... nice, long, and just... <laughs> it was in what? There, it's a movie called King of the Ants. I remember seeing it because my you... dad randomly rented it one day years ago. You know, when Blockbuster Video was still a thing. I was like, Ty, brought it home. see that penis. And the moment that I that I sat down, like three minutes later, there was just a huge cock in it. Oh, jeez. But it's just like a dude standing there. It was a weird scene where the guy was like in a shed with him. And it wasn't, it wasn't sexual at all. It was like disturbing. It was like okay. a disturbing scene. And then it was just like a dude, like a, like a big white dude, like a big old, like moderate bush. You know, and like just a big meaty white dick, and I was just like, "All right." And I remember thinking that, like, I, I obviously don't have the taste in vid in in art house movies like my dad does. Right. Just like your dad he, is looking at meaty dicks. Yeah, I don't think he knew either. I think he was a little upset with it. <laughs> is 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 meaty dicks the uh, the asylum version of Mighty Ducks? Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Oh, fuck. Um. No, but I. Uh, I I not in the same sort of vein, but I have been uh, I've occasionally caught uh, shows made for women. Now mm-hmm. that uh, like my my wife is watching, you know, just shows on Netflix and yeah, yeah, HBO or whatever that are like targeted towards women, and the dicks in these shows are like 
like twelve inches flaccid. About, yeah, like uh, what is, what's like, the what's the new one? White something? White Lotus. White Lotus. Yeah. yeah the, and the the actor even comes out. He's like he's like he's like for you to see. He's like obviously I wore like a prosthetic, but he's like for you to see my penis in this shot, my dick would have had to be twelve inches long. Yeah. He's like, there's no way. <laughs> And then there's another there was another show that she watched where uh, I didn't even I didn't see the scene, but uh, it was, it was uh, Big J was doing the the bonfire. Yeah, yeah. And he was just like, oh yeah, I stumbled upon like Christine watching this show where this dude is showering and he has a no bullshit like 15 inch flaccid penis, <laughs> and you're like, like. Wait, what's going on? Here? Yeah, why, why do you why do you have this? <laughs> like, of course, like yeah. What, do people what's think the, that that's real? <laughs> what's the other big show? Not White Lotus, but it's like it's supposed to be in um, like Castle Times, but there's like black people somehow. And uh, oh, you, wait, House of the Dragon? No, <laughs> not Bridgerton. <laughs> Bridgerton. Yes. <laughs> dude, wait a second. Yeah, there's Castle Bridgerton. Times, but there's black people. God <laughs> Bridgerton. <damn> it, <laughs> Okay, yeah, no, that's it's fair. It's Bridgerton, and there's just like all of these weird, just it's a, it's 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 smut, but like but it's not on the screen. Somehow? Yeah. yeah, but it's on the screen, you know. And I remember my girlfriend just sitting there watching episode after episode, yeah. And me just like, like just being on my phone. I'm like, I don't want to watch this, you know. But I'll also, I've been playing video games for five hours, so she gets to watch yeah, something now. And she just <sighs> watched ten. Ten. Nice. Welcome back, dog. <laughs> just watching this shit for hours and i'm like wh- why are why are you into this like what is this and i'm just gay like sex is it gay sex i think she's in it for the gay sex she does like watching dudes jerk off <laughs> oh i thought you were gonna say something else yeah but that. that's the thing though See, but that's you're thinking gay. yeah exactly connor's thinking of it as like i'd never watch a guy jerk off yeah i have though gay to you because you're not into guys jerking I gotta off. Pee. I gotta be. No, 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 no. <laughs> we just, we just, we just sailed over. I gotta be, dude. Him being like, oh, you're, you're like, oh, well, it's, it would be gay to watch dudes jerk off. And Connor was like, well, I have. But then you just kept talking over. It. I was he like, he hasn't though. I, he has. Yeah, he probably has. He has. Let's be, no, honest. Let's be honest. I mean, it started with they had tits, and then it. And then he was like, what if it. Didn't. What if they didn't have tits? <laughs> what if it was a, just just a guy alone Coming. in this room? What if I just paid a guy to talk to me while he did? It? <laughs> yeah, exactly. And then it turns into something. What if I sell my farts? You know, <laughs> what if he's like, I could monetize yeah, my farts. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, he was like, I don't want anybody. It turns into how do I make money on my asshole? Real <laughs> quick. It starts with tranny porn, and it ends up you're a prostitute now. So Arguably, slip- that is the path. Slippery slope. That Archon Con took. Yeah. <laughs> was he, started, he started with the T-porn, and then he yeah. ended up selling his butt. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, legit. <laughs> or no, not selling his butt. The well, products, yeah, merchandise. The products of his butt. Relating to his butt. Yeah, yeah. The efforts of his butt. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he, what is it? Uh, well, we don't have to air that literal dirty laundry. but uh, What, him getting fucked in the butt? No, no, no. Him. I think we've aired it. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, no, no. Him uh, in the fart space, I suppose we could oh, say. Oh, that's not dirty laundry. People know. Oh, is that real? Yeah. People know? Yeah. Okay. Well, then fuck it. Connor's a fartist. He is a fartist, dude. <laughs> He's a fucking Picasso with his ass. <laughs> Michelangelo with the toots. I don't know why I tiptoed around that one. He's a... Fartist. He's a fartist, <laughs> if, you, if you will. <laughs> Dude, I love that. Also, though, this is like a weird fucking. I guess gonna be like twelve minutes where we're all gone for at least a portion. Dude, we got of it. pissed. Look at the beers we drank. People understand. Look at People what we understand. did. It's a fucking full. We did a thing. Gone. Well, you hit all of the mics on that, but yeah, yeah. Great. They need to know. They heard it. They did. Yeah. It's they an did. audio medium there, Lex, so they got to know when I throw something in the room. Actually, no, you're, you're right. We do get, yeah. like, six audio listeners. If, in, if ONA was worried if the mic was going to be ruined, 90% of their bits would not have. Yeah, I was going to say, they would not have befriended been. Pat from Wanaki yeah. if they <laughs> were worried about the microphones. It wouldn't have happened. <laughs> 
Yeah, they wouldn't have thrown those poker chips at the nice lady from uh, what's that fucking casino that Ant goes to all the time. I can't recall. Oh, uh, fuck. Is, like, is it Mohican Sun? Mohican Sun. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I fucking love that our, going, our joint remembrance of this show. Mohican Sun and a lady comes in with a promo of po- nice poker chips like a professional set. <laughs> and Opie just grabs them and throws them at her. Dude, yeah. And you hear it. Well, like, you hear each chip hit the ground. Actually, though, that is that is the, the perfect sort of... Uh, Example of someone who's because uh, because we had talked about this I guess previously when we were talking about uh, jokes that people could pull off versus jokes that people aren't necessarily skilled or beloved enough yeah. to pull off. It's the same thing with Opie with Opie and Anthony. Why does that always happen? It's a real tongue twister. Opie yeah, it and really Anthony. is Opie and Anthony. But Anthony, Opie and Anthony. <laughs> Anthony always had, like, the finesse to get those jokes off. Yeah. And then Opie... Oh, uh, fuck it. Opie. I did it again. Opie. Opie. Um, Opie was always clunky as fuck with those jokes, and he ended up just looking like an asshole. I don't think like he was asshole. clunky. He was just brash. Like, Opie just really... Opie really didn't give a fuck. Well, that's... But that's the point, though, is that he ended up looking like the asshole. Yeah, because he was. Well, yeah, exactly. And Anthony was just there, like... Finessing yeah, jokes Anthony in. was trying to tiptoe around it to get to the point, whereas Opie would just get to the point. And I would <laughs> like, argue that that Anthony in this case is the people that were like they're doing it right. They're they're finding the nuance, that angle on the joke. And Opie was the person who is just pulling a Say Michael it. Richards, yeah, just being like, like, oh look, there's a, and you're like, wait, no, 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 yeah. you can't do that. Jesus, Opie. By the way, dudes, we're at an hour. Oh, we are. Yep. Gang, gang. Gang, gang? Gang, gang. Everybody subscribe to the podcast. Mansgendered is the name of it? Yeah, Mansgendered. Uh, Patreon, fucking YouTube. Subscribe. Apple Podcasts, Spotify, whatever you want.